Hi, my name is Kambiz Mosoviza, the author of 38 books, and I want to speak about why Dragon's Den is a better show than Shark Tank. I've watched both of them for so many hours. I'm talking about binge watching both of them, like hours on end, right? Into the morning. I've done it with both of those shows, right? Shark Tank is corny. It's so corny. Maybe, maybe it's the way they edited it, right? Because there's no way, first of all, in either of those shows that anyone shows up there and they just like pitch in like a half hour show and it's done. There's no way it would take like eight hours, 10 hours, right? Some of the pitches might take 10 hours. All the paperwork gets looked at, you know, they talk in depth, interview with each person, you know, it may take hours on end. So there's no way, you, but they edit it down. And maybe the way that Shark Tank edited it, it just seems corny, right? And the way that Dragons then edited it, it just seems very serious. And even though like the all in Dragons then too, like you have like Duncan Banatine, he's cracking jokes. Peter Jones is throwing some crass quips. The other guy's throwing like, you know, saying something else. James Conn's coming with a very serious, like, you know, like grilling them. You know, Theo Casitas is like, I'm not going to give you my, you know, he's being funny too. He's like, I'm not going to give you my child's inheritance. All of them are coming with something, but it's just, maybe it's the way it's edited, right? It's the way that it's edited. Dragons then seems very serious and, you know, for a very serious audience. Whereas like, and it's, it'll still be funny in between, right? But, you know, the way that Shark Tank is edited, it just seems very corny and almost chaotic. And maybe they edit it that way on purpose. And that's what it is.